All right, today is the day. We're gonna be updating something very important to make sure you guys are picking up as much as you possibly can when it comes to increases in combat power, increases in damage because your team has better characters now, and make sure you're taking care of this because again, with all the free tickets that have been dropping, there is some important stuff to be aware of. Let's jump into things here. New to the channel, like and subscribe. Helps out a ton. Giveaway ongoing. You gotta comment down below in order to again enter in and you gotta be subscribed. Consider doing so. As always, if you would like to support me, link down below in the description or pinned comment. The third gift code will be sent out as soon as I receive it. Again, waiting on Netmarble on that one. It does have a thousand essence stones. Again, if you are in need of any of the codes, again, let me know down below. Make sure to support up. Consider doing so. Link in the description, pinned comment. And again, I can send out the codes accordingly. With that being said, let's hop into the video here and let's talk about everything. So, with the newest update, we have a brand new revamp again to a lot of the banner systems. First things first, we already talked about this. The banner over here has been updated. So remember, when you are pulling, you can now actually lose the 50 50 and still be somewhat happy unlike me again last video but you could still be somewhat happy whether you pull mirai go gun he on semi mainland fisher over again uh suyun over here ceo emma anybody else again there are brand new options brand new additions to this banner you also have a bunch of new weapons also which is very nice beyond that is not what we really care about we mainly care about this officially we now have the new banner here for custom draw we have three brand new additions and some of these additions are very good to go and put on your game so again are you in need of a stronger character are you in need of doing more damage in guild boss remember picking up some of these characters that have been added or the weapons that have been added they will increase your dps tenfold because some of them are very freaking good so today thought i'd talk about this update what you should be having on your roster here and what you should be updating here as this new update again has a bunch of things to the, pull these banners so we're gonna go through it and jump right into it here so first things first right up who is the brand new characters first the brand new character here is go gunhi the other brand new character is han semi beyond that the newest weapon is the demon daggers first things first let's establish some facts here how good is go gunhi very freaking good he is one of the best characters if not the best characters when it comes to dpsing when it comes to breaking when it comes to supporting his team he does everything you want go gun he to do if you are trying to take guild boss seriously you might need go gun he you trying to take anything that is light weak content you might need go gun he very very powerful character and very very important character if you are looking for a massive increase in dps for again guild boss or other content remember he put he pushes and boosts light team so much he allows cha to become an absolute like decimating machine obviously speaking you should at least have one copy of him his weapon is where the shining comes from when it comes to support but again getting him to a3 is a very big thing too allowing him to be a better breaker be a better dpser and be a much stronger character han sammy is an outstanding supporter also who again is more filtered under the win category this is a character you can look forward to in supporting your win teams for a guild boss or for whatever you need this character she is used in a lot of top tier content and she is a very important and very good character to have remember though in order to to get this character you should already have a powerful win character that already being mirai obviously speaking you now need your windbreaker so again that is a free character everybody's already picked up which is over here here yeah <laughs> i couldn't see his face for a second but again for win team han semi is a great pickup so again consider going for her if you need her but the one thing that i really need to talk about the biggest thing here demon daggers these things are insanity dude listen they are they are insane i talked to my discord uh absolute homies hooked up and again gave me all the analysis of what they went through and basically they've been talking about it for a lot i've also been able to test this and look through a bunch of videos from again kr who are loving this weapon it is insanely powerful and almost a must have when it comes to clearing content faster when it comes to baron when it comes to so much stuff it is an insane insane weapon if you are looking for a powerful weapon you're going to need to go and acquire yourself some demon daggers here because they are insane. But what do you want to slot in? Let's talk about that. What are the best options to slot in? First things first, I always stand by it. Alicia is one of the best characters for slotting in. That will never change. I also think that, again, Mirai, Go Gun here are great characters to slot in. I do think that he should be on your top three list of trying to slot in a character here. I do think that he has so much potential, and I do think that he's a great pickup. Obviously speaking, Cha is still great too. That doesn't change. Han Semi is a brand new, again, supporter for uh, Wind, which is still, again, great to have. Uh, Melee Fisher for Water is still kind of great to have. Um, beyond that, I would say, again, this character here can be looked at a little bit later. Obviously, most of us have this already from early game, or again, if you're a brand new player, you can pick this up later on, I think. Um, and you also can pick it up from, you know, um, 
well, no, the, the event's gone. Can't get it for free anymore, but it is still a decent pick. But beyond that, again, what does it look like for characters? I think that this is a, de a decent roster in order of who I think is powerful. Again, you could say this way also. I still think Alicia is a great character to have, and she's almost a must-have for Wobble and other stuff. And uh, I still think that she's like a powerhouse. But uh, again, when it comes to characters and when it comes to this rate up over here, I always recommend 50-50-ing it, where again, you have two characters and again, two weapons. I still think that that's like the best way to do things here. Don't just full send characters, because again, Sung Jin Woo will fall behind and both need to be equally helping and both need to be equally strong so again that's what i think but go gun he should definitely be on your roster and think about it again whether it goes through this method whether it goes through just these two whether it goes to just these two just think about it right what when it comes to weapons what are the best weapons i still think that the order will be like this these four weapons are very powerful whether you go plum because you need a dark weapon whether it go wind because again you need a wind weapon and we are in a requirement here to have a really powerful one i think the demon daggers is a must-have and if you are losing out on this weapon or not getting this weapon for a few weeks to come you're definitely falling behind when it comes to again dpsing and when it comes to completing content that really requires this right west wind is powerful but i do think demon daggers inches ahead by a mile because again it is very very strong moon shadow over here also for again a dark weapon and a fire weapon over here being the bow these weapons in my opinion remain to be the best that's it these are the best in my opinion so if you are in need of a powerful weapon again i would say that what what my rate up will look like moving forward again i would like to do these two my Alicia is A4 now. I'll, I'll get her to A5 at, at a point <laughs> whenever it happens. But these two definitely need some dupes here. A3, A1, uh, I definitely need to give them something. And then again, I want to pull this very badly. And I still want to dupe my freaking sword over here. I have an A2 uh, or 3 of this, but I still only have an A1 plum, which is insanity. This game does not like me when it comes to that, but... I definitely, again, need to pull this for the first time. So what does my rate up look like? It looks like this. I definitely think, again, getting Gogun here here uh, and duping him will be the best bet for me. So I'm going to do that. When it comes to this rate up over here, very simple. Do you need Plum? Go Plum. Go Demon Daggers. I think that's the best way to do it. Um, if you need Fire Weapon, a lot of people are still chasing a Fire Weapon. You could, again, consider Fire Bow, another very powerful weapon. And again, go Demon Daggers. If it's not Fire Bow, go this way. Zeke's Fragment is great. But I do think that, again, this is a really good um, option to go for. But... If you don't want Moon Shadow, you like more uh, play style of Ze uh, Zeke's Fragment, and you like the power it gives you, that's there. Again, Scotty, not really much. Uh, this did get buffed, but I don't think it's like anything compared to this, and I would definitely say that this still remains to be like a better pick. This is a better pick, uh, and this is a better pick, right? Uh, the other weapons, I think, are, again, um, kind of... Eh, you get this for free, obviously speaking. Still, Huntsman is great, but I think that, again, when it comes to this right up over here, Demon Daggers has to be a confirmed spot. Whether it be Plum, whether it be Moonshadow, whether it be this, it's up to you. But what is mine going to look like? Mine's going to look like this over here. I want to pull Demon Daggers, and I want my Plum to get duped out. Those two weapons are dragging me behind. First, I don't have the Demon Daggers, which I hope to pull soon. Again, I will do my summons over here. I've saved up 154 for this day. I've saved this since the last patch. I burnt all my summons in the um start of last patch once we had knowledge of this weapon coming out i started saving i was able to amass 154 summons so again great news for me i'm gonna hopefully uh get lucky on the <laughs> spanner over here and get myself some demon daggers but if not here then here i am close to pity so again hope that i uh, which i am guaranteed to win the 50 54 by the way i am guaranteed so hopefully i just win on the side of the uh what is it the the uh, demon daggers and then again i'm good to go but make sure to update this now make sure you are increasing the right characters remember it is big dps jumps when you are duping the right character if you're still going with some like day one pulls here and duping the wrong characters you're not going to see much of an increase some characters get like a huge jump up in this game when it gets a3 when it gets a1 just make sure you are pushing those characters to those points and not leaving them to die when it comes to the original points they've been at, right? Always make sure you're duping the proper characters in the proper area. You better be getting yourself an A3 Cha or an A3 Gogunhi. That's where you want to be. Mirai, try to get her A3. She's very good there. Try to get Alicia at least A1, so make sure she's on there to at least get that. Han Semi, get her A1. She's very powerful when A1. Up and coming, Charlotte and Harper, the reason I'm telling you to spend now, because they require A3. And if you don't have them now, that's four whole copies you got to pull up if you have them that's three copies got to pull which is still an insane amount to kind of dupe them but i would say right now is the best bet to look into the banner with again go gunny there's other characters here too um and haunts me and again demon dagger so my take is that do what you will peace out enjoy it's been it for me hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll catch you tomorrow yeah